Hi, it's Ken again, Solar App Films. Today we want to talk to you about the proper way to do evaluation on your on your greenhouse films. Uh, I've gotten thousands of requests and people have always compared our film to 6 mil poly, which is fine. Uh, 6 mil poly is dirt cheap, not a bad way to grow, but depending on the way you grow and what you want to do, the investment in Solar App will make sense. It's one of the reasons why we're doing it. Um, Solar Wrap, you know, again, totes a 10-year full warranty against UV degradation. It also has a uh, snow load over 120 pounds, wind load over 112 pounds. And there's something interesting about Solar Wrap that the other poly guys don't do, okay? The six mil guys. So our film is built on four foot, five foot, and six foot spacing, okay? And so imagine your greenhouse, it has bows, and you put our tracks on every bow and it curves, okay? So imagine now you put all your skins on and, and the film on the tracks get fed into your greenhouse and now your greenhouse is covered with solar app. Year one goes by, two, five, eight, ten goes by. Some crazy storm comes through, someone angry at your farm and they drive a tractor through part of your greenhouse. Well, the area that they drove in, you just repair these if they're broken and you actually pull just that section of film out you back it out just to, like the way you, you put it in. Then you slide in a new piece. Scenario number one. Scenario number two, you have a high value crop, tomatoes, peppers, cukes, and you have six mil poly. Again, nothing wrong with six mil poly, but you get a breach in the middle of a torrential storm. And that cover comes flying off, ripping across. You've seen it. And so what do you do? Can you go out there and put another skin on during the storm? No, you sit there and you watch your crop basically get pummeled. In soil wrap situation, we don't, we're not dealing with 30, 40, 50 foot wide pieces of plastic that are 100, 200 feet long. We're dealing with at most 6.5 inches, which is two meter, or in most of our cases, six foot. And you pull out the bad piece and you can slide in the good piece um, during the storm and your crop is saved. If you get a small failure, it's okay. You know, the film doesn't have a run. It has a run stop built into it because of the way the bubbles are designed. And so you might have a penetration or two, but you don't lose your crop. So that's another way to look at the valuations of, of your greenhouse films. In our next series, we're gonna talk about heating and cooling and how to take measurements on that. Um, and we look forward to talking to you again. Thank you so much.